In today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to verify with BlockSync using a mobile device. For PC users, I have another video for you up here at the top. So let's start verifying. The first thing we're going to do is type slash verify in a server that has BlockSync added. Next, we'll click the verify with BlockSync button. This will take us to the dashboard. Once the website loads, we'll click this menu button here in the corner and then sign in with Discord. You may be asked to log in. Pause and log in if you need to. Once you get to this page, go ahead and look at the top. Double check that this is your correct Discord account. If it isn't, we'll have some problems later, so make sure it is. After double checking, let's go ahead and click authorize at the bottom. Now that we're logged in, go ahead and click the menu button again, but this time click go to dashboard. We can start the verification process now. Click the shiny verify now button. In the first box, let's type in the Roblox username we want to link with. Now we have two methods to verify. We could join a game or we could put a code on our profile. For this video, I'll be choosing code verification, but you can use whichever method you want. So I'll click code verification and next. This is the code we're going to put on our profile. So I'm going to click this little copy icon on the right so it can copy to my clipboard. Or you could just highlight the whole thing and click copy. Now let's head to Roblox, either the app or the website, and go to your profile. Once you're on your profile, click the edit icon next to about. Then paste in your code into your about box and click save. Now we can head back to the website and it should put us in the next step. And that step is to choose which servers we want to verify this account on. Now, I recommend everyone watching this video to click select all here in the middle because this will verify you automatically in every server you're in. However, if you want to verify in only some servers, then you can go down and select which ones you want. But like I said, everyone else should click select all and then click confirm. And we're done. You've successfully verified your Roblox account. Now we can head back to the Discord server and retype slash verify. And all your roles should have been given to you. And that's it. If this video helped you, be sure to subscribe and like. And if you have any suggestions, put them in the comments below.